guy, Kevin Blanche, back the Fukushima fucking nightmare. The media's dropped the fucking ball again. The print media, the television media, everybody's fucking mind, and it's the same old routine. It's run its fucking cycle again for the third fucking time. Oh, this is going away. It's over. It's not fucking going away. It is not going away. Do not fool yourself out there. Do not think because you're not seeing anything in fucking any of the newspapers. Online has even fucking dropped the fucking ball. You're not even to see fucking reporters fucking reporting anything now. Look, that fucking Fukushima fucking is still in fucking meltdown. It's still catastrophic. They still have no plan to entomb the motherfucker, which it should have been done. How many days are we? How many days are we now? We're coming up on fucking a very iconic day in America, fucking Moon Day. Do you realize how close Moon Day came to being a national holiday? Within a couple fucking votes in Congress. Wouldn't that have been a great holiday? Wouldn't that have been a cool fucking day? You know, we try to get Earth Day moving as the environment. We don't care. Yeah, and I'm fucking wearing black today. I, I don't, you know, it's the middle of summer. I I know it's hotter than fuck out here and we're burning up. Oh yeah, climate change doesn't exist. Extreme weather patterns doesn't exist. We could just blow all this fucking shit into the fucking air for 30 fucking 40 years. And it's just like everything else. <laughs> we could just make up in our minds what we want to fucking believe. The reality and fucking structural fucking deductive thinking means nothing. It means nothing. Logic? Fuck logic. We are dug in. Fucking Rupert Murdoch feeds the right whatever he wants them to fucking do. And you got to give it to Murdoch. He grows this fucking vast empire, not just in England, here in the United States. And we have turned into fucking England. The fucking Neil Far fucking right. He feeds them anything. And the corporate CEOs board sit around and just fucking laugh. Fucking the fucking GE who build all the fucking energy fuck things. They're, you know, they pay no taxes. They employ nobody here. They fucking put nothing back into our fucking society. Look, if you read in the inception of the pure corporations themselves, how they were conceived by the forefathers and how the structural courts build up the corporations. Read what the first line says, all the courts, including the Supreme Court rule. Read what they say. It is up for the good of the country. That's what corporations were set up. They backdoored every law there ever was. They go to China, backdoor any environmental fucking law whatsoever. So fuck, we build up fucking these fucking laws where fucking pollution was finally falling in this country for years, especially California going down. We cleaned up the auto emissions or whatever. Now back up because it's flowing in from China. Fuck it. You can't just fucking clean up here. It's got to be cleaned up globally. We live on a global. You ever heard of the fucking jet stream? Things fucking flow. They're fucking destroying this fucking earth in China. China is poisoning this earth via us going to Walmart buying our shit. The fucking boards of these fucking corporations are sitting around, and I know what they're saying. They're saying just like when Scott McClellan wrote his fucking book about the Situation Room and Bush and Cheney and all of them used to sit around. Why the evangelicals in power put banners up on the church. We support our troops and our presence, even though this is a fake bullshit Christian murderous fucking war. You know, we support them. They get up on the pulpit. Yeah, yeah, go boys, go boys. Yeah, hey, when none of them ever fucking served. You talk to any man who's ever been in the fucking theater who has killed Talk to any of them, every one of them. We all have uncles and fathers. We all fucking know. I grew up in a family like that. I know how they, they drink straight fucking whiskey. They fucking check out. They're violent. They're fucking, they commit fucking suicide. They don't ever speak of it. It destroys their fucking mind. None of those fuckers ever fucking went. They stand up, get them on the pulpit, being fucking so-called Christianity. As we destroy this earth, as we destroy a fucking culture of men, as we destroy a whole culture of fucking growing up. Think about if you were born in the last 10, 15 years. Think about our youth. What have you seen in your face? What have you seen? Nothing but fucking lies, 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 lies. Murder, murder. We have diluted human life so dramatically. We have no respect for fucking human life. We have no respect for the human experience. Experience. None. We've diluted it down so grotesquely it is fucking sickening. Speaking about the human experience, we're coming up. My favorite time of year, August, Saratoga, Del Mar. I'm old school. Any of you guys, I'll be in Manhattan soon, taking the train to Saratoga. Anybody want to go? I'll be in Del Mar very soon. Anybody want to hook up and go? You're free to go. We can have a lot of fun. Come on. Let's get back to fucking caring about each other. Let's get back to be deductive thinking. Let's think about our money and our jobs. This has been nothing but redistribution of wealth for 30 years. That's all it is. We have dissolved for 40 years. We're not evolved. We went to the moon fucking in 69. This whole fucking shell thing, everybody that fought right here where I live is employed, boy, is nothing but fucking another manipulation of fucking money and fucking wealth. Everything's, everybody's got their piece in the pie. And the same people that are bitching about fucking these entitlement programs are the same people that are drawing fucking farm subsidies, a la Michelle Bachman. And if you don't think Michelle Bachman and this guy in fucking Iowa, if that is pure 
fucking racism. Call it what it is. People say, oh, she signed it. That fucking statement, those guys signing, these guys signing it, that is pure, unadulterated racism. Purely call it what it is. She is a fucking racist. Both those assholes, Plenty too, they sign it, they are racist. Excuse me, sorry, Plenty. Santorum, racist, racist. Call them for what they are. They are fucking racist. Not just the blacks, not just the homosexuals but also to Hispanics. Do not fool yourself out there if you are brown. They love you as long as you're mowing their fucking lawn and you're getting cash that are exploiting you. They are racist. Kevin Blanche.